Okay, Paso Chico's Cuban Collector here, and we are live from Miami's card show. We got some vintage here I'm gonna put up, I'm sure with you guys, so stay tuned. I'm back so we got a nice stack here of cards from the card show I'm gonna share that per table I have everything organized per table so the first table I went to is some big dude there and he has his laptop and just there I'm gonna look at his laptop but he has all his cards organized so that's a key to organize all your cards if you're a dealer so what he has them by team and then in my head, um, and that's a way to search. So I went to the Marlins. I searched to see if they had any um, Jose Fernandez stuff. None. And so then I had a, a card I'm about to share now. I had it, but, but uh, without um, the autograph. And I'm like, um, let me go to the uh, Nationals and see uh, what he has. And uh, luckily, he had the same card I have in my eBay card already, but with the autograph. So I just said yes, and I'm gonna take it. So a uh, Uneski Emea. So he plays now in the uh, um, Dominican League. He's a, a four-time champs. He was born in Cuba, and he lives um, down here in Miami. So, and I don't know what 
to these guys um, they get paid in those other leads but this guy has a pretty nice house and drives a nice car so and that's that and then we have a wonky Garcia a rookie card so I did not have that for my Cuban PC and it's number out of S25 and a, a cool thing um, I never paid the it, ticket price at all for none of these cards so then I went to another table it, there's a big dude there also and he's a Cuban and he has a big a white beard and he's seen me before and the first card that he showed me he's like hey man I got something for you look and, it, and it, he remembered that I collect the mini and Minoso and uh, Jose um, I'm a Fernandez but he, he popped up with this I was like what I've never seen that so maybe John um, the Evangenia collector has this um, he probably has a full set but I've never seen these so they're called the 1984 a True a Value Baseball. And I like how this guy has all his cards that he sells. They're all um, labeled. And it was a price. And I and I did not even pay that. But once he is on this, I'm like, yeah, I'll take that. So great. It says Cuban Great M. Minoso. Then I'm um, like I had a bunch of Cuban stars and all that, so I picked up um, a few of them. Um, some posts, um, Ariel, um, Pascual, and then a Pedro um, Ramos. And again, with the labels. And for my uh, 1956 set. Another Cuban star. And it's actually in good condition. Just the uh, um, turning a little bit off. So that was that table. Then another table in front of him. I picked up this card. I saw it, which it has. So it, so it has um, Kobe. I'm a future Hall of Famer. It has Shaq. And it has Tim Duncan, and then in the back of the card, look, it has three more players, which uh, two of these are Hall of Famers, and one is soon to be a, a Hall of Famers as well. So uh, he had it for two bucks labeled, and he gave it to me for a buck with this card as well. Um, uh, Jose Abreu. Um, a rookie card sharp then the last table I went to I picked up all this so it was a bunch of Cuban players um, some guys I didn't um, even have he just won a world series with the uh, nationals um, he played in different teams in the Marlins and now he's playing in the Dominican League in which he just won from over there the championship Alex Guerrero I just picked up his autograph a few videos ago so on my RC he's all a rookie cards then we got some Bowman gold Order as well, as well. So Pedro um, Lasso, which I believe he's in Japan on um, a plane, and um, a Cepeda. So these guys are really um, much about them. Then we have a Rasel Iglesias rookie card a Jose 
Iglesias uh, with Detroit. Yeah, old school in the farm. And then we have a local and Miami boy, also from the Cuban background, Gio and Gonzalez, which he is good friends with Jose Fernandez, and I've talked to his brother before. Um, his brothers was a best friend with a Jose. So that's all the cards I picked up, guys. So it was a fun um, card show, and I plan to do it again um, next month. It's only once a month in a Fort Lauderdale. So don't forget to stay humble and positive, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Dale, chicos.